Okay then, so tonight you join me back at the Norbrek and this is what you get for 26 quid tonight to book this via a Golda. Let's go and check in and we're going to have a look around. Okay, so I'm on the fourth floor tonight. Still not fixed this lift though. I've only got one side of the lights working. Oh well. Four, five, three. There we go. Quite presentable though, isn't it? All this has been painted. Okay then, so this is what you get tonight. Wow, what a shock this is. So all this is new furniture. Right, let's get my bag down and see what's what. Okay then, so for 26 quid this is what I've got tonight. And this is really good. So, straight away I can see they've got new furniture in here. So all this furniture along these drawers, bedside table, desk area, and chair, and wardrobe, it's all brand new. With the flat screen telly, this looks all right. Now I can tell that bed's not new, but I'm sure it's not going too good with that leg there. It's a bit skew with, but, this looks all right. I've even got a phone. Don't really know who I'm gonna ring, but. Right, well, what else have we got? So, the wardrobe's got plenty unstealable hangers in there. This carpet's new. And this has been hoovered as well, you can tell. It's like nice and clean. Wow, how is this a worst rated hotel? We've even got a picture above the bed. What an improvement this is. So I can tell they've had some work done because last time I was staying here they was doing all the radiators and it's lovely and warm in here. Obviously they've not got room to paint in this copper yet. But for the price, wow, this is so cheap. So we've got a hairdryer there. What else have we got? Anything else? Right, over to the desk area. Well, we've got a brand new chair. That's leather as well. And I can use that as a desk or a dressing table, whatever I need to. Happy days. We've got plenty of the cheap old tea and coffee. All your milk, sir. That cups are facing the wrong way around, but is it an issue? And the kettle was open when I walked in like this, so is it clean tonight? Well, yes, it is. Look at that. That's a new kettle as well. You know, I don't really have problems with kettles at Britannia. They're usually on it. Right then, so have we got a sea view? Well, no, we haven't. So I can't really show you outside because it's dark. I'll show you in the morning. So a couple of marks on the windowsill here from idiotic guests. And all these windows are quite cloudy. I can't really see out of them. But how much time do you actually spend looking at the window at a hotel? Really? So, onto the bathroom. Well, first of all, actually, before we get into the bathroom, we've got a nice big flat screen telly there. So that's good. Right then, so this is a bathroom. So it's a bog standard basic bathroom. So you're not gonna get any luxuries here. But, wow, this is clean, it's sparkling. So, not bad at all. Nice big sink, I can tell that's new as well. I've got a new shower head and riser. Now then, every time I've stayed here, the pressure has been really good. But I will test it again. Okay, so I had no doubt that this would be a good shower. So, nice and warm, loads of pressure, just what you want really. And they even give you complimentary uh, shower gel. So over to the sink now, we've also got complimentary soap here, just for you. So, um, a couple of cups, nothing special, but nothing else needed. So, parking at this place is actually £3 a day parking. Um, so, obviously I don't want to pay that all the time, so... A little tip for you, just park outside on the road, it's free. What I will say is, if anything happens to your car, on site here, Britannia are not going to pay for it. So why bother paying? So I just park outside on the road, where most other people do too. So this hotel has actually got a spa. It's got a pool, a jacuzzi, a sauna and a steam room, um, as well as a gym too, so 
I can't check that out tonight because I've arrived a bit, bit bit late, so I'll be going in in the morning. Join me in the morning, guys. Right then, guys. So it's the next day now. I know to sleep. Well, I slept really good actually. So this bed, yeah, it's a bit old, just a bit uncomfortable, but I can deal with that. This quilt, however, you can tell it's new. It's quite thick. It's definitely a winter quilt. So yeah, happy days. Didn't hear any noise last night, and I've just had an amazing shower. So, can I complain for this price? No, I can't. We didn't really get a view, but I'll show you. So these are really good blackout curtains, but there's paint all over the windows. I always find this at Britannia's. Every one I go to, there's paint all over the windows. So, yeah, not bothered about the view, but you could call it a town view, I suppose. Um, right, I'm going to go and have a look around this place. Let's go and have a look. You can join. So all these corridors have been redone. I think I'll take the stairs. Actually, with my swimming stuff at the minute, I'm going to go swimming. So it's two pound extra, which is nothing, is it? So we don't smell musty either. Must be a long, big job this though. Ah, right, okay, so some dust still remaining. There's some buckets there full of water. Because it's literally streaming down the walls. God. It's, it's wet through so yeah the buckets <laughs> that's not what I say but you can tell it's uh, an ongoing project everywhere you look everything's been painted so new carpet going as well throughout so give them some credit definitely a project so then, this massive thing there so they've got an Elvis convention on at the minute. And this is where your pool is. So you just go swipe your key card there. Um, but yeah, that's a pool through there, if you can see. So it's a pool area. Quickly get it before no one's in. Uh, there's a jacuzzi just the side of me here. I'll not film that though. Crazy, isn't it? Quite a big place. This was all green mouldy and full of crap on the roof. All this has been sorted now. It's going so hard, isn't it? So there was entertainment on last night as well. I want to get away with garden furniture at Britannia. This is where your bingo is. Um, there's also a quiz on and an artist as well. They've even done, uh, redone the restaurant too. So they've even got a bar through there that was open last night. 
So all this has been recovered, all new chairs, even a little cafe here as well. Garden furniture in a bar, wow. So there's a ballroom that's set up for a boxing ring. Okay then, so that was it for this one. Back at the Norbreck. Let me know in the comments below what you think. Do you think it was worth the 26 quid? I, personally, I think it was really good value. Okay then, so if you like what you see, don't forget to hit subscribe. Till the next one, guys.